I was just looking oh my up god, his name. Oh my god, what did you hear about the IU thing? Oh my god, yeah, she's dating Lee Jong Suk. Dude, wild, you okay? Know, like, I literally just saw that. And she used um, together. I didn't know this. I didn't know this. Like, yeah, somebody even, posted mm-hmm. like really cute old photos of them against the speech yeah. that he gave, and then I was like, oh, cute. And then, like, the whole thing came out, and I was like, whoa. Now, 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 beautiful to watch and um, please turn on your captions so that you can watch like read the lyrics along because it's genuinely wonderful okay he even mm. got the beat had a comeback sm is just like throwing all their super groups out sorry i was saying you i know i saw it <laughs> <laughs> okay i think that's all for what's up open it's time for us to get into it yeah Oh so singles in for no for anybody who's living under a rock and hasn't seen it or has like actual has a real life and doesn't want to waste time watching crap uh is a reality dating show
So a lot happened. Good for yeah. her. Um, I think another one of the big controversies that happened on Singles Inferno was something that I think as Asians, we've sort of grown up with this, but I think a lot of the West hasn't experienced maybe as strongly where we have such, we, I mean, our beauty standards with being fair and fair and lovely and Gora is like the best thing possible. Mm-hmm. But, um, and like a lot of people in Singles Inferno do say that they're like, oh my God, she looks so pure and wonderful and white. It's pure, fair. No, no, no. So it's pure and white, like white and pure. Like that was the mm. sentence that basically got highlighted. And a lot okay. of people from the Western audiences were like, oh, what is this equivalence? Why is being like, what is this colorism happening in 2022? So let's start with season two. Let's start with some of the main people in season two. Okay. So there's, I'm going to be uh, very honest straight off the bat. I can never remember people's names. Yeah, I, I can't either. I'm using a cosmopolitan guide to singles inferno character uh, members. Love that. <laughs> okay. So there's this guy called Jin Young, who for mm. some reason, the girls love. Yeah, no, I feel like he... I don't get it. Like, I, I feel like even with season one, where Jia was the most popular girl amongst all of them, I didn't get it. I think, I think I got Gia. I'll tell you why I got Gia because she she like played hard to get in a way where she would give them uh, some attention and then she would take it away and she always kept them guessing. I think when you're a hot girl and you're like doing a little push and pull, then everyone's like, mm. which I think is some, what's happening with Jin Young. Okay, let's start with like because I think that's a shorter list. <laughs> I, I think I might agree. Something I like. I think it's a great w- insight for me personally to look into the like dating culture in South Korea. I feel like I really don't know much about it as such, like as a, mm-hmm. as a viewer. It's very interesting to see how you have to talk a certain formal. way. Behave. It's so formal, right? Yeah, exactly. Talk a certain way, behave a certain way to be considered mm. okay. Mm. Uh, which further proves to me that I would never survive in that country. <laughs> Yeah, and I think additionally, not just in terms of dating culture, but uh, it's like you are on a show and a lot of times we associate reality shows with controversy and people going over the top and being really loud. But I think celebrity culture in South Korea is so different where people who are respectable get more attention. So these are Mm. people who are probably aiming to have their social media careers or whatever pop off after this show. So they're all very poised and like... Uh, presentable and good people presenting which mm. I think at least coming from India where you have shows like Big Boss and Roadies where Hello. everyone wants to be the baddie and the most controversial person it's it's interesting to see the South. <laughs> everybody no no it was just a joke I feel like I grew up on reality TV massively and like I still mm. watch it to this day it doesn't feel as Too produced. fake Ha, huh, it doesn't mm. feel scripted, it doesn't feel fake. Some things, of course, you know, are like what you're saying, people are putting on a front, and that is of something course. you can't help. Everybody um, does that. Like you do that in real life. That's exactly. Smart. You do do that in mm. real life as well. So but it there there does seem to be like a sincerity, a genuineness to people there. Mm-hmm. Okay. Are we done with the good things? I think <laughs> yeah, that was a very yeah. short list. <laughs> so now everything we hate about singles and porno. I have and- like immediately straight off the bat, my biggest problem with Singles it's Inferno. It's so boring. No, is okay, sure. But like my biggest problem with Singles Inferno, there is no Inferno. Like why yeah, is it called no Inferno? No, you mean there's no spice, there's no heat, there's nothing. Um, it's not giving. Like I want mm-hmm. some, like what am I looking forward to? What is keeping me watching this? And it's a dating show and I want to find out who picks who and that's it. But I think... Um, it doesn't give us a spice and I think it should be more produced for that. Like they do need more I production. Agree. I agree. They need, there needs to be production involvement. Even if it's just things like setting up dates, maybe pushing people yeah. together, maybe doing some of that like backhanded manipulation that Bachelor <laughs> does. Okay. Where yeah. is this? Because like, True. honestly, I know you don't, you don't appreciate this, but like I absolutely need to fast forward through all their boring conversations because like baatein to koi bhi kar sakta hai. Okay. Second thing I dislike is uh, related to I think the production thing, the way it's done where you can't uh, you you can't pick the same person to go to Inferno or to go to Paradise right. twice. I think that is so flawed because what it does is is it removes 
the opportunity for people to actually build something with another person because if you're only there for seven days out of those seven days you get to go to paradise maybe on an average two to three times and if you're only spending those three times with like three different people then that's not enough time i think to develop something which is something too hot to handle if you've seen that that is the reality show you should check out <laughs> something that <clears throat> something that i don't like about the show and i don't think it's anything to do with the show itself and i think this is maybe just like how people are in south korea they're very secretive secretive isn't the right word but like nobody seems to be talking to each other yeah hmm. like even amongst so they are separated by men and women in two different hmm. uh, tents and it feels hmm. like the men and women just don't talk to each other also to be like True. hey what is the vibe with this person this and that or like hey i think i'm getting along with this one more and so that the others can make their own assumptions like it feels very reserved like, not reserved like they're like waiting the- it is reserved like they're not proactive and again if if that is the case then it is on the production to to push that right like it, it, be like yes. hey go pick a person to go on a walk with or why don't you select a person to go talk to if people aren't doing that i get what you mean maybe that is how culture is maybe that's how dating culture is or maybe uh, i don't know maybe they're just shy <laughs> whatever it, it is is that but like how shy are you bro you're on a netflix dating show you exactly. i don't think shyness is your problem no so yeah so dating culture is group based and maybe that's why they have the group cooking activity but everything is so groupy where everyone cooks yeah, no, together everyone yeah no but even in that, right it's like cooking together is fine i think that's some like I, you do like if you're cooking for 17 people it does take like a lot of why effort why are they cooking <laughs> a uh, sure why are they cooking but like th- even within that right when they go to get the water like four ha- people have to go and it's just like do log jao na thoda like hand touch karo na kya kar rahe ho have like some in- sexual tension over the like tap opening do something that's no tension that's the thing there's no tension because everything is so friendly and no my problem with the cooking is i'll tell you because it's not even like there are gas stoves or anything right they have to like blow the wood fire and make like whatever dhakkan pe paajon bana whatever it is what it does is it's taking away time and this is again <laughs> one week and usme se if like five hours you're spending on cooking with the group how is this a dating show i yeah, don't I know if this is the final me. one but this is the i think okay maybe this is, cooking is not the worst but this is probably the worst the panel <laughs> oh yeah no they need to they need to leave not, yeah they need to not be around the ve- like dahi is very beautiful i agree and she's there with her fits every time but like n- no like nobody in the panel has anything insightful to say they do they contribute nothing they do nothing they just like oh, oh they just the panel is like if a guy and a girl are walking together then the panel will be like oh look they're walking together the other person will be like hmm the third person will be like maybe they like each other and the fourth person is not there because this fourth guy like the other guy like the two women and uh, Ki- kihoon from super junior bless you thanks sorry Ki- kihoon from super junior they at least talk i think the other other guy only he is in love with one of the contestants and every time that guy comes on he's like oh he's so dreamy he's so charming his charms are so wonderful <laughs> he blushes every time that guy comes on street scream scream <laughs> that took a while but other than that nothing no the entire panel's contribution to the show is so limited i feel like season 1 they were still doing a little bit more this time mm. they just feel so blah and i cannot believe in this show where i have to fast forward through the contestants talking to each other i also have to fast forward through the panel talking to each other i think our episode on singles inferno is way more interesting than the entire show i don't even think i'm going to finish it because i can't like maybe i'll just see at the end who wins who ends up with who gets who. together yeah, yeah. like um, the new episodes are coming out tomorrow mm-hmm. and like i know that i will watch it the same way which i which is just like skip 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 acha isne kuch okay those two are talking okay skip 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 because i can't i'm very sorry i can't like watch it the way i yeah. normal shows are watched are you ready for a k fact 
which is thematic as well okay Okay. so um a lot of cultures and a lot of laws especially like if you're a a desi person indian you will know that adultery is not allowed however in south korea legally legally you are allowed to be an adulterer since 2015 it has been made a law where it is considered a personal choice what you want to do with your uh, marital status cool that was our show for today for this week yes <laughs> it was a k drama or a k flop and uh, based on the fact that we've seen one and a half seasons k eh... hey, flop <laughs> <laughs> no, for me, I think I'm going to stick till the end of season two to announce whether or not it's a K-flop. But so far, it is heading that way. So maybe. Mm-hmm. We will be back next week with a brand new episode. Uh, until then, remember to follow us on Instagram at Nuna Talk. Subscribe to this channel and like this video. Especially if you share our opinions on Singles Inferno. If you don't share our opinions, leave a comment saying why not. Hey, do you realize we're both wearing green today? I'm wearing my mic drop and idol sweatshirt. Oh, nice. I dropped something. Okay, bye.